My name is David Shield, I'm assistant head teacher at St Thomas More School and we are the first school in the North East to be delivering T-Levels. T-Levels are vocational technical qualifications, the government's flagship qualifications. Their aim is that they are the gold standard qualifications that sit side by side against A-Levels. Very different to A-Levels because one of the big aspects of them is having a significant industrial placement that the students go on. St Thomas More has had a long-standing tradition of offering vocational technical qualifications over the last 25 years. When the, the call came out from the DfE that they were introducing these new T-Levels and they were only eligible for outstanding schools, we obviously thought this is an opportunity for us to get involved. We tick all the categories, so we applied and we were really delighted that we were offered two of the first three parts pathways. T-Levels enabled students to have a much broader look at the curriculum. If a student comes along who is interested in, in T-Levels, I think the important thing is to, to show them that T-Levels are a really worthwhile qualification. T-Levels are a good option for students who perhaps don't want to follow traditional, very academic A-Levels. Nothing wrong with A-Levels, they are a gold standard qualification, but this is an opportunity to have an additional gold standard qualification and they give students that opportunity of developing skills that they would get in the workplace along with some hands-on technical experience. Because we were one of the first adopters of T-Levels, it gave us a real opportunity to help shape the way we deliver the courses. The students have been fully involved in that. The T-Level allows the students to uh, expand the knowledge of the subject and the practical elements of that subject to a greater degree than a more practical traditional A-Level subject would do. I think students should consider taking T-Levels because they allow the student to really expand that knowledge and that practical side of the subject that they're really passionate about. They're able to then to use the information that they have in the lessons to go into an industry placement. Once they've used that in the industry placement, there are the opportunities there to take that into their real life work. As the awareness of T-Levels increases, we're starting to see parents become more knowledgeable of these as courses and inquire about how they can deliver an effective education for their children instead of the traditional A-Level route. And that's a real benefit to us and to the students as we see these qualifications grow. One of our students, Callum, began on the A-Level Computer Science course. After a short length of time, he realised he wanted to expand his ability to, to do programming and to use that in what he was really passionate about, which was creating games and creating apps. And so he came onto the T-Level course and he excelled in the T-Level course and has now found himself in an apprenticeship doing exactly what he wanted to do in the first place. Well, initially I had taken three A-Levels, but over the course of the first half year, I spent the majority of my time focusing on computer science, programming. It just really caught my interest. Most of my time, whether in lesson or out, I was more interested in what I was going to be doing next with coding, projects, all that kind of computer science stuff. It just took away from my time in other subjects. And so having heard about being able to take computer science as your main and only subject through T-Levels, it just seemed like an ideal option. So we decided to offer T-Level placements at Infinity 27 after working on the T-Level pilot hosting T-Level student and previously exploring apprenticeships as an option to get skilled people into our industry because there is a large skills gap in our industry and we need to fill that with bright young people. Well, by far what I enjoyed most was the work experience. Being able to go from schooling to working in an actual workplace for the first time is a really useful experience. 
So I think it's very important for people to have hands-on experience of the world of work um, because there is a difference between your ability to learn a subject and then apply that subject. So it's been a positive experience that we've had with the students. Um, really enjoyed the time with their perspectives on how the technology can be used. So a lot of the technology that we use can be used in more creative ways than we thought. And it's always nice to see people have that aha moment when they realize the maths thing that they learned that was a bit boring um, in the classroom actually has an application in real life and that they thought of that and how to apply it. I think there's a lot of anxiety when it comes to what's going to happen after you leave school. Being able to have the school manage your work placement all based off what you want to do is really really useful. It just acts as a fast track straight to what you need to do outside of schooling. What was really nice about Callum in particular was that Callum came to us from St. Thomas More School. Uh, he was on the T-level and I believe he came from a different course and he wasn't too sure and kind of went on to the T-level. The nice outcome that we had was that as soon as he got into the studio and started working with his team, it was very evident that he had a level of skill that was quite promising for his future career. And we helped him nurture that skill and kind of focus on a bit of a leadership role. And um, so we let him exercise that and he did really well in it. And the rest of the team really looked up to him and trusted him in that role. So of course it was a no brainer at the end. We wanted to offer something to Callum so we could re-engage with him through an apprenticeship. Yeah, no, changing to T-level was probably the best decision I could have made. Full focusing on something I was passionate about just is a good idea. So it paid off in the long run, definitely.